Are you looking for an abs workout that leaves you feeling tight, toned, and lengthened out? Then this Pilates abs workout is for you. You won't need any equipment. I will show you the modifications along the way. So if you're ready, grab your sneakers, grab your water, and let's work out. Hey guys, it's Melissa and today we have a five minute Pilates abs workout. We are working for five minutes. We have five exercises and each exercise we are going to do for that full minute. So if you need any rest, just go ahead and take it and then jump right back into our workout when you guys are ready. If you warmed up, you are awesome and you are good to go. If not, go ahead and check out my three minute warm up in the description box down below. Otherwise, let's get started right now. All right, guys, we are gonna start down on the mat, laying all the way down in a roll up. So go ahead, stretch your legs out. We're actually gonna do a half roll up. Flex your feet, and we are gonna roll ourselves halfway down, and then right back up. Okay, just to warm up, we're gonna do a few like this, and then we're gonna go all the way down, and roll up. Go ahead, halfway down. Flex those feet, try to keep those heels down on the ground, and roll up. One more like this, you might feel a little stretch in the back of those legs and roll it up, ready? Can we go all the way down? Let the lower back hit, middle of your back, upper back, and then roll it all the way up, reaching forward, and lower it all the way down. So if you need to modify, I'm gonna show you next. Everyone's gonna continue moving as I show that modification. Ready, here you go. You're gonna lift the shoulder blades, reach for your toes, and then roll it back down. Okay, lift the shoulder blades, you're lifting your back up as high as you can, you're just not pulling yourself all the way off the ground. We have three more seconds. Two, and one. Everybody roll themselves all the way up. You are going to come down into your forearms, lift your legs up off the ground, and you're gonna stretch one leg out, and then switch it. Go ahead, one leg, and then the other. Now what I want you to do here is I want you to really press your belly button down towards your spine. Keep your core nice and tight, and just extend those legs. So if you are modifying, what I want you to do, again, everybody's moving, is I want you to do a toe tap. Okay, so I want you to go here, toe tap it out, toe tap it out, toe tap it out. But everyone's thinking, as you pull that leg in, I want you to crunch, crunch it. Okay, ready? Let's challenge yourself. Can we stick both legs out? Bring them in. Remember, stay with that modified if you need to. And if you were modifying, see if you can do one straight leg. Pull it in. Good, kick it out. And in, nice work guys. Kick it out, three, two, and one. We have a nice slow bicycle. So we are gonna come all the way down, put our fingertips behind our ears, lift your shoulder towards your knee, forget about your elbow, and then switch. Go ahead guys, one, and two. Good, cross, nice and slow, and then cross. Point those toes, reach and extend those legs out. Modify, let's do a toe tap, okay? So same type of thing you did on your forearms. You're just gonna tap that toe down. And tap, and tap. Otherwise, full ones, tap. I'm sorry, no tap, reach. Make sure you breathe, inhaling and exhaling, but just let that breathing flow. Do not hold your breath. Come on guys, extend that leg out. Make sure that whole back is pressing down onto the floor. We are almost there. We're flipping over in a plank. Ready? Three, two, and one. Go ahead, we have some openers here. Side plank openers. So you're down on your forearms. Give me an 11 with your arms. Here we go, we're gonna open up and reach. And then switch right over to the other side. Open it up and reach. Really lengthen, so we are not looking for speed at all here. We're looking to reach, we're looking to pull our hips really high up off the ground. And if you are modifying today, everybody's moving again. Go ahead and do the same thing on your knees. Open it up and release down. And again, open up and back down. Stay with it, guys. We are strong and we are almost there. Okay, so full plank or modified making sure the shoulder stays right over that elbow. 
three, two, and one. Everybody's in that plank. Hold it right there. We're gonna do a saw, so I want you to shift your weight forward. So your shoulders come in front of your elbows and then shift back. Shift forward and back. Nice work, forward and back. Now if you're modifying, let's go on your knees. Okay, so you're gonna go knees to fall. Knees to fall. Come on guys, belly button towards your spine. Everybody engage their core. You can do this for another 30 seconds. You know you can. Come on. Or you're sawing it out, so you're shifting forward and back, and you're keeping your core nice and tight. Do not quit on me here. Stay nice and strong, you can do this. Nice deep breaths. Inhale through your nose, push it all out through your mouth. Nice work for three, two, everybody hold, and release all the way down. Let's take one big stretch all out, inhaling. And exhale. Nice job, guys. If you have another five minutes, I want you to go ahead and do another Pilates abs workout. I'll put the link in the description box down below. Let's go ahead and take one more deep breath in. Lengthen out. Exhale. And release. And remember, guys, along with fitness goes nutrition. So go ahead and check out my healthy, family-friendly cooking videos as well. And if you enjoyed this video, I would love it if you would go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell notification as I post short and effective workouts on Mondays and Fridays and healthy family-friendly cooking videos on Wednesdays. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.